Diana. All right, thank you, Laren. We're just a week away from the Dancing with the Stars finale, and last night, there was a shocker in the ballroom. Victoria Arlen and Val were sent home. But you know what? We're on the lucky side of that because they are here now to talk to us about the competition. And, you know, you guys... Thank you for coming in this morning. You know, it's a, a tiring, long trip to get here. But you, you really were incredible. And, Victoria, you had your first two tens last night dancing to Charleston. So how <laughs> tough is it to go home after that? Uh, it was devastating. I mean, we our two dances last night were probably the best we've had all season. And, and we just felt so good with them. And that Charleston freaked me out. I think I was doing that Charleston move in my sleep to prepare for it. Um, so I was really excited. I mean, last night couldn't have gone greater until the end. But um, I'm really proud of what we achieved and the fact that we did get those tens. You should be proud of that because you were paralyzed. You were paralyzed for ten years because of a childhood illness, and you just really started walking about a year ago. So Val, what was the challenge for you to get Victoria on the dance floor and have her do all these things? Um, there, there was a couple of challenges here and there, but, you know, with every challenge, there's a great opportunity. I'm so grateful that the show trusted me with this incredible young woman, and I got to tell her story. And it's not every day that a dancer gets to fulfill himself through, you know, embracing family. And, and, and just, like I said, her story was so inspiring. I'm just really mm -hmm. proud to be a part of it. And speaking of family, when you were 10 years old, you told your mom you wanted to be on Dancing with the Stars, and she has a little message for you. Oh, no. Victoria, when you left to come to Dancing with the Stars, you said you wanted to impact the world in a positive way through your dance. And you did that after your first dance, Victoria. We are so proud of you. The fact that you are even walking, let alone dancing, we couldn't be more proud. And we love you so, so much. Oh, man. Yeah. And we gotta say we're 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 proud of both of you. We we love having you here. Very proud of both of you. And um, you know what? Do not miss the two night dance with the